you know what movie I watched last night? What'd you watch? Uh, Violent Night. Oh, it's so great. It was... Loved it. Quite good. Yep. I wouldn't say it was so great, but it was better than I expected. It's just fun. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah. It was kind of like Die Hard meets Home Alone meets something else. The Santa Claus. Yeah. Yeah. That. <laughs> Definitely that. Uh, yeah, we just decided that we're going to, for the next few nights, we're going to watch a, a Christmas-themed horror movie every night because there's quite a lot of them out are there yeah some of them are going to be really bad that's fucking but no. no 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 yes it does it does sound no. horrible it's there oh, they're gonna be shit i know they're gonna be shit no they're not uh, name one that i know i would know heard of oh i don't think you would have really heard of any of therefore the they're gonna be but shit you don't watch horror movies doesn't mean i haven't heard of them well i mean well, i mean i do my own no, no, what would be a Christmas horror that you might have heard of. Like Black Christmas? No. Have you heard of that one? With the girls? It's kind of like a you know, style slasher one. movie. No. Um, that was a really popular one. I've heard of Nightmare Before Christmas. Nightmare Before Christmas. Uh, I think we're going to watch Krampus. We've both... You've heard oh, of Krampus. Oh, I have Krampus. heard of Krampus. Yeah. Okay, We've cool. both never watched that. Sure. So I think we're going to finally give it a go. I hope it doesn't Krampus your style. <laughs> Hey, good morning, party people. Welcome to Breakdown with Nathan and Johnny. Today we're checking out Amonamoth, Saxons and Vikings. <laughs> Big surprise. <laughs> Huge what? surprise. What could we name this one that no one will expect? Puppy dogs and rainbows. Oh, imagine that. That'd be great. Uh, we have checked out Amonamoth on the channel before. We've had Amonamoth on the channel before. Yeah. Uh, and perhaps Amonamoth fans will have hated that intro we just did. Because they're like, oh, I don't care. Who the fuck are these guys? It's about the music, not about us. So That's right. get over it. Yeah. Just stop being a little bitch. But also, love you. <laughs> what do you say? And like and subscribe. Hey, anyway, do you know what I was thinking? What were you thinking? Play. Whoa. Oh, treat yourself. You would make that joke. <laughs> Sick red. It doesn't matter. Oh, I like that. We stand for fleas. We will bring it to his We lay waste to the Oh shit. We have cocked yard. Here they come. We ravage all these lads without another remark. Another day on the This is so driving. Yes. It's relentless so far. His expressions whilst pronouncing it are quite aggressive. Yes. It really fits the, the vibe of it. I love the enunciation of the words and things. Yeah, you can well, read yeah. very clear and just the way they sing. Um, Not even their first language. Yeah. Such a maiden vibe to him, hey. Who is that? Look, I don't know. I'm gonna just take a stab and say maybe it's Saxon. Biff the band? Byford? Well, I'm oh, guessing yeah. so. Saxons. Saxons are. Yeah, maybe he's from the band Saxon. Okay. Because I'm not that. I didn't them. know that was a band. I'm not but didn't you? up in that. This is not my style of music now. But there we go. I'm guessing he's Biff. Biff Byford, over 70 years old and still has an amazing voice. So I'm guessing that's Biff. Yeah. He does have an amazing voice. He does. Yeah, very Bruce Dickinson. Very.
I love that riff. Oh shit. That's sick. It's great, isn't it? Who are you picking to win? Um, there's only one answer here. Vikings. Yeah, I'm rather far more terrified. Yeah, because they just have Look zero at that guy. fear. No offense to him. He definitely works in IT. <laughs> Oh, love it. Oh, let's go. Are we gonna get some dual band shred? I love the axe throw to prepare for the next move. Woo! Sick. IT guys ripping the shit. Shred your face off and then fix your data connection. Uh, I had to pause it somewhere. I want to pause it so long ago because you talk about throwing an axe. Yeah. And I thought it'd be really funny if someone throws an axe and someone throws a guitar. Like, you said throw your axe! And that'd be really funny. Very good. But um, also. This is sick. I, I'm a huge fan of this sort of like these sorts of movies and shows, and this is just done really well and choreographed really well. Yeah. Um, and it's just fun. You know what it reminds you of? What? Role models. Oh, <laughs> that dude. battle scene. Oh, what What do they call him? What's his name? Ah, oh, I can't remember his name, but it's something really funny. His, his name is actually Augie in the, in the movie. Yeah. I watched it recently. Again. The, the actor? N no, no, no. Like the name that he gives himself on oh, the battle show. Sure. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Remember. That was fun. That was so fun. What a great music video. All of great the music, music video. videos that we've checked out have been so good. The whole vibe is really fun and interesting. Yeah. But I thought that as a, a collab thing, which I didn't know it was going to be, that was such Me a either. wonderful surprise. Because yeah. I feel like it added a really cool, interesting dynamic. It was a really good song as well. And I, I feel like they utilized each band, like each vocalist so well. Sure. The call and response thing was a lot of fun. So that was great. well done. Yeah. yeah. That was really good. Uh, and Biff has a fucking great voice. I, like, and I know that's not your... Like, I know I've heard them before, but they've never been a band that I've gone and gone, well, oh, going to go listen to a Saxon album like I sure. would with Maiden or Priest or someone like that. So I would definitely be interested in, in checking more of their stuff out. And obviously they've been around for a while, so they've got probably a shitload of songs. You imagine so. Yeah, that was rad. That was really fun. That was fun. a cool little surprise. Um, I like it how they, I like how they made it engaging and fun and cool and violent without the need for the over the top gore, which I have no problem with, but I think it gives it a better reach. Sure, for people to enjoy. Yeah, it's more stylized. Yeah, but in like a cleaner way. Cleaner way. Yeah. yeah. What did you guys think of Saxons and Vikings, the brand new seemingly collab track between a Monomath and Saxons? 
Comment below, let us know your thoughts, and we shall see you guys in another video. Ah! Yeah, I'll agree with that. <laughs>